Perhaps one of the most noteworthy aspects of the 2012 Nissan Versa 1.6 S sedan is its price. At just under 11 grand, it's one of the least expensive Japanese new cars for sale in America. Hello again, this is Dave Erickson for TFLcar.com. But if you think it's low price means you won't drive in relative comfort and get your money's worth, think again. The Versa isn't about style, oh no, and to be quite honest, it's forgettable, conservative, and plain as the day is long. In fact, its brilliant silver exterior looks like every rental car I've driven off the lot, but that's not why you should consider the Versa. So what do you think? Should performance enter the equation when considering buying a 2012 Nissan Versa? Probably not. Its 1.6 liter engine puts out 109 horsepower with the CVT. So fuel economy, not performance, is what makes this attractive. So forget about winning stoplight drag races in the Versa, unless of course your competition is on two legs. More on the Versa's real competition in just a moment. The Versa's utility is one of two areas that makes this vehicle, I think, stand out. It has some of the best in class room, enough for five adults, and here in the back seat is what may surprise you the most, it did me. Nissan claims its rear seat provides more leg room than the BMW 5 Series. And they may be right. It doesn't look like it on the outside, but when you're back here sitting down, there is tons of space. A big upside to this little car. Okay, let's talk competition. If it has two legs or even four, don't worry about it. The real challenge for Versa is going head to head with Ford Fiesta, Toyota Yaris, Honda Fit, Kia Rio, and Chevy Sonic, to name a few. Fuel economy is the second area where Versa shines bright. Expect to get 30 miles per gallon in the city, 37 on the highway, which is impressive for a car that offers much more room than many of its top competitors. Now here's one of Versa's weak points. To achieve a base price tag under 11 grand, Nissan needed to cut some corners, and the materials in the car are rather basic, including very hard plastics and not much in the way of sound deadening. It feels a bit on the tinny side, and your key entry is a throwback to the Stone Age one place to lock and unlock and that's the driver's side door and each remaining door must be locked from the inside a pita if you get my drift so to sum up the 2012 nissan versa 1.6 s sedan is as basic as they come yet economical and deceivingly spacious in the back seat on the tfl car scale of buy it rent it lease it or forget it i'm on the fence between rent it and lease it if you lease it you're stuck with it for a couple of years so maybe rent it and enjoy your weekend. Until next time, this is Dave Erickson for TFLcar.com.